what you've done for me. Thank you, Lord, for what you do. Hey everyone, Matt here, Home Farm Ideas, and I thought I'd do a little follow-up video on the last video that I did, the bell pepper one, putting the bell peppers in my uh, aquaponic system. Um, there was a lot of leftover soil and um, I wanted to sift through it because these were actually in my grow beds. I just put the pots directly into the grow beds and um, I noticed when I was taking the bell peppers out of these pots, there was a lot of worms. Um, and so I already sifted through this a bunch. I'm just gonna go through it a little bit more um, to see if I missed any stragglers. I did and then show you guys kind of what I have um, what I've basically found already um, there's a couple cool things it's not just the worms um, well it's the worms but uh, uh, let me get done with this real quick I don't see anything else oh I see something else Let's see the normal untrained eye <laughs> would miss this, but I'm not missing it. Okay, that is a red wiggler egg. Okay, and uh, let me take these over to my aquaponic system and then I'll kind of discuss it a little bit more. And I'm going to sift through this and see if I can find any more of these eggs. So, okay, so. Didn't find tons and tons of worms or anything like that. Um, I mean, I found a good bunch here. Let me see. So, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, let's see, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So 12 worms out of that, um, which I'm going to be putting back into this grow bed here. Okay, so those those all break down waste, and uh, so very beneficial. Um, but then the other things that I found here, let me see if I can get this on camera, without the dirt. Let's see. Oh, let me readjust myself here. Okay, so let's see if I can zero in on that. Come on. Of course. There we go. I'm trying to be careful so I don't crush this thing. But that, my friends, is a basically a worm uh, egg these eggs um, the, this is a red worm egg these eggs could basically produce um, anywhere between I think it's like 10 and 20 new worms and I found four of these so let me get, grab those I did notice the size difference though in these other ones um, which is fine. Maybe they have less or something like that. But anyways, see, there's one there, one there, there, and then there's another one I think in there. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get it all out, but I just wanted to basically uh, show you guys these things are like breeding like crazy in my aquaponics system, which is awesome. So if we were getting 10 out of those, that's you know 40 new worms in here that's going to be hatching out. So. Let's go ahead and let's put these back in my grow bed and let me shift the camera here a little bit. These are the jalapeno or the uh, pepper plants that I just put in this grow bed. And so I'm going to basically put the eggs back in and I'm going to put the worms back in. So doesn't matter where you put them in the bed, they're going to go everywhere anyways. So and then that's it. Uh, you don't have to worry about the little bit of soil either because it's fine. The worms will process it. And then you don't want to lose these. <laughs> right? You know what this is. Everybody should know what this is if you're getting into aquaponics. Yeah, that's right. These are those pebbles right here. And uh, these pebbles actually uh, uh, produce or give the bacteria a place to live. So 
you don't want to lose these though because they're expensive so um, anyway I'm, I should have some videos coming up actually on this as well um, just to show you guys that uh, I'm gonna be basically building way bigger grow beds and uh, I'm looking forward to it so anyway if you like this video give it a thumbs up like always you guys and uh, questions or anything comments below uh, if you got worms in your grow beds uh, let me know so anyway God bless you guys and like always peace thank you guys so much for watching our video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up also hit that subscribe button to get all our video updates oh yeah we do have other channels now so please check them out like always, God bless.